Hi everyone, Dr. Pat Vickers here from the Advanced Gerson Therapy Clinic. Uh, those of you who already know me know my story, but for those of you who don't, back in 1996 when I was a year away from graduating from New York Chiropractic College to become a chiropractor, which I wanted to do since I was 11 years old, a woman by the name of Charlotte Gerson came and spoke at our school. Uh, she is the iconic last living daughter of Dr. Max Gerson. Uh, who Nobel Peace Prize winner Dr. Albert Schweitzer called the most eminent genius in medical history. Eight movies have chronicled Dr. Gerson's work, no other therapy in the history of medicine can remotely boast but one, if that. Why? Because no other therapy in history can do historically what the Gerson therapy has been able to do, most notably in, in you know reversing advanced cancer, but uh, we're reversing virtually every single degenerative disease. And in fact, Nobel Peace Prize winner Dr. Albert Schweitzer himself, eight years before he won the Nobel Prize, had severely advanced diabetes. Severe diabetes. Dr. Gerson completely cured him in six weeks. That's standard. If someone comes into our clinic with type 2 or a certain type 1 diabetes, typically within four to six weeks we have them off all their medications. Why? Because diabetes is simple. Now how is this possible? that we're reversing diabetes typically within four to six weeks and our patients are getting 3,500 to 4,000 calories of sugar a day. Well, that's because diabetes has nothing to do with sugar. Yes, you heard me say that correctly. Diabetes is not a sugar problem. And I'll get into that in more detail in a second, but let's just talk about diabetes for a second. Let's define it. What is diabetes? Well, diabetes is when glucose accumulates in the bloodstream because it cannot get into the cell and it cannot be properly broken down into energy. That's the way your body functions. It breaks down food into energy by converting glucose into energy with the presence of oxygen. So inside your cells, you have these little things called mitochondria. The mitochondria take sugar, glucose, and they convert it into energy if and only if oxygen is present. So in diabetics, they're not able to do that and they get glucose accumulating in the bloodstream, which causes a myriad of cascading effects, ultimately leading to premature death. So what the issue is with diabetes, it's not sugar, it's actually fats and it's actually maybe salt as well. So we're gonna go into that, like I said, a little bit here, but did you know that nearly 30% of America is either pre-diabetic or diabetic? Now, there's two types of diabetes, right? There's type two diabetes, which is probably 90 to 95% of those pre-diabetic and diabetic cases. And then there's two types of type one. There's type one where the body's actually still producing insulin and we can completely reverse that if that's the case. But you need to get a C-peptide test in order to determine whether or not your type one diabetes, you're still producing insulin. And if you are, that can be successfully treated. Then there's the type one diabetes where your body's just not producing insulin. End of story, it won't. And that's due to typically vaccines. That's due to uh, maybe too much dairy at a very early age can cause autoimmune reactions on the islet cells of the pancreas that produce insulin. Uh, or it could be viral. There could be some kind of viral infection that did the same thing that destroyed the islet cells of the pancreas. Nevertheless, for this lecture, this talk, we're gonna be talking more about the most predominant type of diabetes, which is type two diabetes, which uh, is 90% or more of the cases that people are dealing with today. So again, diabetes is not a sugar problem. It's a metabolic problem. You know, if you have to go back and listen to my two part series on metabolism, cause you're gonna have a greater understanding of why diabetes is occurring today at such rampant rates because it's a metabolic issue and it's classified as one of the metabolic diseases. So the problem isn't sugar. The problem is the body's ability to convert sugar into energy. And the real crux of the matter is fat. So your body produces insulin. 
and there's insulin receptor sites on your cells that carry insulin into the cell so that the mitochondria can convert it into energy. Well, today, the fats that we're eating, typically the saturated fats, which are saturated with hydrogen that are going up to make your cell membranes, well, they are preventing insulin from getting into the cell and converting that sugar or glucose into energy. So our high fat, high cholesterol diets are preventing insulin from binding to insulin receptor sites on the cell so the glucose has to hang out in the bloodstream. So what do you do? Well, the Gerson therapy, which is a no saturated fat diet, which is extremely high in essential fatty acids because we give a lot of flax oil on the Gerson therapy, it literally melts the fat off of the insulin receptor sites so that glucose can be carried into the cell with insulin. So you literally have, and this is called metabolic syndrome, where you literally have cholesterol, which is hard at body temperature. That's why it can clog arteries. Cholesterol clogs arteries because it's hard at body temperature. But if you take flax oil, which is a completely unsaturated, polyunsaturated fat, do you know what it does to cholesterol in the human body? When it meets up with cholesterol, it literally dissolves it into solution. So that cholesterol will literally melt off the insulin receptor sites so that you can carry insulin into, or glucose into the cell. That's one of the reasons why the Gerson therapy is so effective in reversing diabetes. The other reason why is because it's a non-fat, no saturated fat diet. And it goes and it cleans up all of that in the body to make insulin more effective. Not only that, when you restore the proper fats at the level of the cell membrane, you can now get oxygen into the cell, which the mitochondria need in order to convert sugar into energy. How do you make a fire? You need oxygen, right? Well, the mitochondria, your fire producing factories of your body, your energy producing factories, they require oxygen. When our cell membranes, which are made up of fats, are made up of the fats that we're feeding it, which are the saturated fats, cookies, cake, ice cream, meat, cheese, eggs, dairy, you name it, we're eating it, and that's going to make up our cell membranes, which are made up of fat. That's what's maintaining that cell membrane. So those saturated fats are preventing oxygen from getting into the cell. And so you reverse that diet and you supplement with the proper things. And that's why within four to six weeks, our patients are typically off of a majority of their meds and maybe eight weeks if it's really, really advanced today. So the other issue is once you've now cleared insulin receptor sites of the fats that are occupying them, you now have to restore the integrity of the internal portion of the cell which again, we've completely destroyed with our massive consumption of salt. Salt has swelled up our cells with salt and water so that the mitochondria inside the cell that convert glucose into energy can't convert glucose into energy efficiently. So by getting rid of sodium out of the diet, which is what the Gerson therapy does, it's an absolutely no sodium diet other than what naturally occurs in fruits and vegetables, and you bombard the body with potassium, well, there you go. You now can restore the internal integrity of that cell so that the mitochondria can now convert that glucose that now can be brought into the cell and be converted into energy. This is how you properly reverse diabetes. It's so simple, and it's so simple a child can understand it. And how many billions of dollars every year is the pharmaceutical industry making just on diabetes alone? Astronomical amounts of money. So, you can see why YouTube and Google have now censored the Gerson therapy because of the threat that it is to the pharmaceutical and medical industry. Diabetes is not an issue of sugar, it's an issue of the fats, and the salt 
within our diet. You reverse those things and diabetes is so simple to cure. If you like this, please like our YouTube channel. Uh, visit us at gersonclinic.com. You can reach me at director at gersonclinic.com. If you're suffering with pre-diabetes or diabetes, we have a three-month home program people can do for such a, such a problem. You can find me uh, on gersonclinic.com or director at gersonclinic.com.